It's the first time that I'm here, and I was super excited because I've been to Italy like twice, and I loved it. And after watching the movie, being able to be here and to go back to those places that we've been shooting, it's like my fan moment. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah, some, uh, some people say I remind them of pizza. I eat a lot of pizza. <laughs> I love pasta. I like eating carbs. Uh, so for me, it's a dream come true because I like food and uh, Alfredo sauce. Um, the Coliseum premiering at the Coliseum is not a bad, uh, you know, cherry on the top. The top, the yeah. Fettuccine Alfredo, as they say. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I was biking uh, last night with my agent, and we were like at the fountain, at uh, the Spanish stairs, and at the Coliseum, and I'm and I was able to see like uh, everyone putting the things together and structure and everything. I was like, oh my god, this looks like. I don't even know if it's a film festival because I've never yeah. been to one, but I'm like, this is huge. Is this all for us? It's crazy. I was a little, uh, just a little apprehensive coming into it because I, I, I don't know any of the backstory, like what was really going on behind the scenes. But, you know, I just had heard, like everybody had in the news, that like there are certain people that didn't get along or that walked away from the project and Justin Lin leaving a week into production it's kind of unheard of and I don't know you know you're like what is going on this must be a nightmare somebody's got to be a nightmare and so I show up sort of like you know you feel like you're gonna be walking on eggshells and Vin who really runs the show here could not have been nicer more generous more affirming uh, he's like very zen and spiritual and why I mean it's just like he's just the be he's a great leader and it, it was like it was like the, one of the best film experiences that I've had so I kind of don't understand <laughs> like mm -hmm. any of that you know um, but it was like it just put to put to, to rest all the you know all the trepidation about what set life was gonna be like it was great mm -hmm. yeah. for me I don't know uh, like the first memories that I have uh, from the about the franchise I never imagined myself being like on it so i didn't have any expectations for me it was like uh oh i don't know i don't know how is this possible but i'll try to be there and live the moment and take everything that i can from this experience and i think i i took even more than i don't know that i that i thought i could i was like oh my god okay so now I'm starting to work on this and prepare. No, of course not. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, but I was like, oh my God, this is getting even more serious than I thought. Yeah, it's, uh, for, yeah, for, for your peers, for almost all your peers to be Oscar winners, it's like, oh, this is, um, this is exciting, you know. But it, what I love about it is it feels like it, it, Fast is never resting on its laurels. It's, you know, everybody, Vin especially, is always trying to find a way to like really push in, you know, into the next level, and it seems like, especially with like Brie joining and um, and and Charlie's returning, and you know, it's like it's grown up. It feels a little, it just feels more mature, and the stories I think serve that really well. So it's, you know, fe feeling that kind of see seeing that happen with the lineup, um, stepping into that um, that kind of team, it was like it's, it's a great feeling. I love Ames. I love Ames. He's mysterious and duplicitous, but you know, it's got a little of that just a little of that charm that is disarming and uh, super fun to play, yeah. I love characters with many layers and uh, like, yeah, I, I love to be thoughtful about my the, the characters that I play and dive deep and deep and deep because why not? Uh, and yeah, I don't know, I, I love to go through the psychology of stuff, yeah. And I couldn't have been, could have been um, more lucky to to do it next to Vin because he's really thoughtful thoughtful as well so yeah I'm really grateful for that and at the same time I never felt that in the in the fast uh, fast saga movies women had to like step up and like bring power because they already had it mm. so that was interesting as well because when I read the script I was like okay I won't need to play tough because Isabel is already tough you know, so that was interesting and, and good. I, I really liked it, that detail. Oh, yeah. Of course. Oh, yeah. yeah. This one feels, I mean, it's sort of uh, like, Vin, Vin has explained it to me, like, you know, this is sort of like one big movie in 10 chapters so far. 
but uh, the fact that this, there's this really great cliffhanger and all these new characters are kind of coalescing to create a ton of intrigue and tension and it just it feels like it's uh, I don't know it feels kind of like it's a, the beginning of a, a new story like a really great new story mm -hmm. but, um, you know so the, the beginning of the beginning of the end of the beginning and I'm very excited to see people's reactions of course to the movie but I'm very excited for them to start the theories for the continuation yeah. and future yeah I can't wait and also, I'm very excited to see their reaction to the fact that they will need to wait for years, <laughs> so for some years, for the next like things. 